Mercer County Schools Policy Review. Mandated Reporting Child Abuse and Neglect, West Virginia Code Section 49-2803. The protection of abused and neglected children depends on the prompt identification of children at risk of maltreatment. Certain persons whose occupations bring them into contact with children on a regular basis are mandated to report suspected child abuse and neglect. Mandated reporters are required to report, by telephone, suspected cases of child abuse and, or neglect to the local CPS agency or cause a report to be made. Who must report? Medical, dental, or mental health professionals. Christian science practitioner, religious healer, school teacher or other school personnel, social worker, child care or foster care worker, emergency medical service personnel, peace officer or law enforcement official, humane officer, employee of the Division of Juvenile Services, member of the clergy, circuit court judge, family court judge, or magistrate. Any coach, youth camp counselor or volunteer in any child organization. Commercial film or photographic print processor. Any person over the age of 18 who receives a disclosure form from a credible witness or observes any sexual abuse or sexual assault of a child. Report shall be made immediately and not more than 24 hours after suspecting abuse or neglect. Under what circumstances must I report? When there is reasonable cause to suspect that a child's health or welfare has been harmed or is at risk of harm or when you observe the child being subjected to conditions that are likely to result in abuse or neglect. Report shall be made immediately and not more than 24 hours after suspecting abuse or neglect. In any case where the reporter believes that the child suffered serious physical abuse or sexual abuse or sexual assault, the reporter shall also immediately report to the state police and any law enforcement agency having jurisdiction to investigate the complaint. Any person required to report under this article who is a member of the staff or volunteer of a public or private institution, school, entity that provides organized activities for children, facility, or agency shall also immediately notify the person in charge of the institution, school, or agency, or a designated agent thereof, who may supplement the report or cause an additional report to be made. Notifying a person in charge, supervisor, or superior does not exempt a person from his or her mandate to report suspected abuse or neglect. Teachers or other school employees must report offenses immediately, no later than 24 hours, to state police or law enforcement who have jurisdiction to investigate when the teacher or other school employee personally observes sexual contact sexual intercourse, or sexual intrusion of a child on school premises, school buses or other transportation. Failure to report. Any required reporter of suspected abuse who knowingly fails to report shall be guilty of a misdemeanor. How to report. Anytime you suspect a child is being abused or neglected, you should report your concerns to centralized intake at 1-800-352-6513. Making a report. When making a report, it is helpful to provide as much information as possible including, location of the child or children. The name, address, and phone number of the child and their parents or other persons responsible for the child. Directions to the home when possible. Birth dates or ages, sex and race of the child. Names and ages of others in the home. Name and address of suspected abuser. Information about the suspected maltreatment, dates and times. How the child functions, behaviors, temperament, feelings, intellect. Names of individuals, staff who have direct knowledge of the incident. Who the reporter is. How the reporter knows about this. Whether the maltreater knows the report is being made. What actions have been taken by the agency. Reporters' opinions about needed actions and child safety. Information about potential safety threats to the CPS worker. Target population. Family in which a child, newborn to age 18, has been suspected to be abused or neglected or is at risk of abuse or neglect by their parent, guardian, or custodian. What is child abuse and neglect? Definitions by law, Code Section 49 one 
Abused child, a child whose health or welfare is harmed or threatened by a parent, guardian, or custodian who knowingly or intentionally inflicts, or knowingly, allows another person to inflict physical, mental, or emotional injury to a child, sexual abuse or exploitation or sale or attempted sale of a child. Physical injury may include an injury because of excessive corporal punishment. Neglected child, a child who physical or mental health is harmed or threatened by a present refusal, failure or inability of the child's parent, guardian or custodian to supply the child with necessary food, clothing, shelter, supervision, medical care or education, when such failure or inability is not due primarily to a lack of financial means, or who is presently without items such as necessary food, clothing, or because of the absence of the child's parent or guardian. Custodian, a person who has or shares actual physical possession or care and custody of a child regardless of whether such person has been granted custody by a contract, agreement, or legal proceedings. This chart will aid you in determining your responsibility in reporting abuse. You must report if you have reasonable cause to suspect that a child is neglected or abused or may have been sexually abused or sexually assaulted, or you have observed a child being subjected to conditions likely to result in abuse or neglect. Report the circumstances to the West Virginia Department of Health and Human Resources immediately, and within no more than 24 hours, 1-800-352-6513. You must report the circumstances to the principal or other person in charge of the entity or organization providing services to the school. If you suspect that the child has been subject to sexual abuse, sexual assault, or serious physical abuse you must report the circumstances to the West Virginia State Police by calling 304-746-2100 and your local law enforcement immediately, and within no more than 24 hours. This chart will aid you in determining your responsibility for reporting sexual abuse or sexual assault. If you believe the contact was not consensual, you must report. If you believe the contact was consensual, but the child was mentally or physically incapacitated or physically helpless you must report. If the child was less than 12 years old and the other person more than 14 years old, you must report. If the child was less than 16 years old, and the other person was at least 16 years old, and more than 4 years older than the child, you must report. If a parent, guardian, or custodian engage in, attempt to engage in, or knowingly procure another person to engage in sexual intercourse, with a child who is less than 18 years of age you must report. Report these circumstances to the West Virginia State Police by calling 304-746-2100 and your local law enforcement immediately, and within no more than 24 hours. To report alleged abuse or neglect contact the Centralized Intake Unit by calling, 1-800-352-6513.